Welcome back from the other video. In part three of this video, we're actually going to clean up all these cuts that we've made. It's important to get all these aligned properly because as we're going to find out here soon, we're going to be extruding these things and we want them all to be aligned both horizontally and vertically. So we've been using this background image as our modeling template but now that we actually have 3D geometry, in case the template's wrong or, you know, in reality, when we start working with our 3D geometry, we want everything to be lined up properly. So we're going to spend the next few minutes doing that. I'll go ahead and walk you through this first part, and then I'll um, go ahead and finish it. I'll stop talking. I'll go ahead and finish it and uh, speed, it up, speed up the process so you can see what's going on. So here what I'm doing is I'm taking the time to manually set some vertex positions and get it right. And believe me, the more time that we spend getting this part correct, the better our overall model is going to be no matter where we take it. But, you know, you can see that I've got a lot of vertices to go ahead and do this with. This could actually take a really long time. So I'm going to want to use a tool here uh, called Planar Align, which is over on the Modify Command Panel over here. Um, make Planar X, Y, or Z. In this case, it's going to be Y. And you can see that all, it aligns all those vertices. If I choose any of the other axes, you can see that it aligns all those vertices on that axis. And those other axes aren't really what I want. But you can actually see a tutorial video I did on this recently on my YouTube channel about making uh, vertices planar or making faces planar. Um, it explains the use of this tool. In this case, we're using it with vertices. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the time and I'm going to select all of the vertices that I want to be aligned on any one particular axis and I'm just going to go ahead and align them. I'm just going to work my way through this model and I'm also doing one axis at a time. So for example, I'm doing the horizontal axis here right now. I'll do the vertical axis in a minute or you know y axis and then x axis. So we'll go ahead and go up there. I can see coming up here that uh, I have forgotten to cut this so we'll go ahead and fix that really quickly now that I have the cuts in there I'll go ahead and align them and we have all of the horizontal vertices all set up so using the same technique I'm just gonna go ahead and align the vertical vertices uh, using planar align just on one particular axis and we'll go ahead and speed through this and uh, finish this model up Okay, that's it. We're all done with this stage. We now have geometry that is nice and clean. All of our vertices are aligned both in the horizontal and vertical axes. And we're ready to add a lot more detail to this model. So be sure to watch the next part of this video. And if you like what you're seeing, please subscribe and share this video with your friends.